okay this is better because the sun's not in my face anymore so I'm going to show you what I did to make that mountain or my mountain erupt because if you were with me this past week we learned all about volcanoes those of you that I will see on Monday that's what we will be doing um, anyway one of the things that we did in class was we talked about the different way volcanoes erupted and that they all don't erupt the same way and so the one that I did in class was more of the type a shield volcano like you would see in Hawaii where the lava just kind of flows out um, but Mount St. Helens and a lot of other kind of volcanoes don't do that. They actually blow their tops. So when Mount St. Helens erupted 41 years ago, it completely blasted off the whole north face of the island. Anyway, so in that last, my little video of me being weird, um, I'm gonna show you how I did that. You may have figured out what it was. So I used that same model. I used a cup and I had put some clay around it to make it look like a mountain. And I put it in a tray. But the only thing that was different this time is I actually poked a hole in the bottom. So I can then, oh, here goes an airplane. Anyway, there's a hole in the bottom of the cup a hole in the bottom here of the pan and so then what I did is I'm gonna bring you guys down here is I used a bottle of coke and then I put that hole in everything and I just set it right down here on top of that bottle of coke and then what you may have noticed in that last video is I was putting something down there it was Mentos! Those Mentos candies! And you may have done this before yourself or you may have seen videos where people, oh my goodness, <laughs> will put Mentos into Coke and it makes the Coke come flying out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it again. Now that last bottle I used had already been opened and I had poured some of it out, but this time I'm going to use a brand new bottle. And the reason I had to take the tray off was because when the tray is on it, I can't undo the lid. So I'm gonna undo it pretty quickly. Oh, I have a feeling I'm gonna get Coke all over this portable. Ay, ay, ay. Ah. Oh, ha, <laughs> silly lady. I don't know if you guys can hear that. That's all that pressure built up in there. Okay, so I'm going to put my mountain on top. I think I'm going to kind of get out of the way here a little bit and move you guys back in case this thing really goes. All right, here goes our mountain. <laughs> that was awesome. There goes another one. Is it going to do anything else? Nope, I think once it blows, that is all we got. Oh, I'm going to pour some of this out. So this is a cool thing about ground and about dirt, is when you get stuff in it, like pouring the coke out, actually, as it moves through the dirt and then moves through the rocks and seeps into the ground, it actually gets cleaned as it seeps down and becomes groundwater. Okay, I'm going to throw another one in just to see if it does it again. And nope, it looks like we lost enough coke. It's not going to erupt again. That was awesome. And now it's stuck. Okay, I'll deal with that in a second. Hey, uh, check the next slide because I'm going to have another volcano video for you. <laughs> Have a great weekend. And, um, oh, I forgot to say it. Happy Friday. Hey.